Qatar's government doesn't want you to visit its country, or at least they didn't when they required that you have match tickets to even enter the country. Although this rule was probably less about coming to Qatar and more about FIFA's effort to combat the black market of ticket sales that's created around the World Cup. Since tickets for some of the most anticipated matches have been sold out for months, some fans have come to Qatar without knowing how they're going to get into the game, with hopes of finding scalpers selling tickets outside the stadium. But selling tickets to somebody is illegal in Qatar because they gave exclusive ticketing rights to FIFA. And anyone caught selling tickets as a third party can be fined upwards of 10 times the face value of the ticket. Now, a Latin American American diplomat in the capital city of Doha said that the crackdown on this sort of crime has been mild at best, which has actually enabled ticket resellers to charge upwards of a thousand percent over face value. That means tickets for matches of some of the event's most prominent teams, like Argentina, Portugal, and France, can go for upwards of two thousand dollars per ticket. But I guess that's the price you'll have to pay for showing up to Qatar to watch your favorite team without buying tickets beforehand, even though it sort of seems 